Now we are doing exercise 10.2, question number 10, Roman number 3. Roman number 3, let me write on the question. Question says 10 square phi. Okay, it is not phi, it is theta, 10 square theta. 10 square theta minus sine square theta is equal to 10 square theta and sine square theta. Okay, minus is here and here it is multiplied. So solution, let us take left hand side. So left hand side, it will be 10 square theta minus sine square theta. So 10 square theta, it is sine square theta divided by cos square theta minus sine square theta. So sine square theta minus sine square theta. So I can write down sine square theta minus if i take the denominator as cos square theta so now cos square theta will go and multiply here so it will be cos square theta sine square theta this one i can take sine square theta common if i take sine square theta common it will be one minus cos square theta divided by cos square theta so sine square theta by cos square theta sine square theta by cos square theta and what's left out is 1 minus cos square theta sine square sine by cos it is 10 square theta and 1 minus cos square theta 1 minus cos square theta is sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 you know this formula right so from here if i find out sine square theta will be equal to 1 minus cos square theta if you transfer cos square this side it will be sine square theta is equal to 1 minus cos square theta so instead of 1 minus cos square theta you can write down sine square theta so which will be equal to 10 square theta sine square theta which is equal to right hand side therefore equal right so therefore it is an identity it is an identity okay let me take the eraser and thank you so much i hope the answer is correct if you have any doubts please do write in the comment below we'll meet in the next video